It's a lot easier than I thought to book a room in a guest house for an overnight visit in Seoul. At first, I had a lot of trouble even finding places that would accept last minute reservations. But sometimes you don't know you're going to travel until the last minute. And in these cases, I just assumed that I was going to have to find some motel in the area I'm going to and settle for it. But this is not necessary. At first, I didn't know what a guest house was. Another word for guest house is hostel. Isn't it weird that a hostel is an anagram for hotels? Anyway, I had heard that it was dormitory style. If only I had known that dormitory style is nothing like a dorm, I would have saved a lot of money on motels. You do have to share a room with one or two or even three other people, but my guest house experience was 10 times nicer than any motel I've ever been to. Just Google Seoul Guest House and dozens of sites will come up with links to places like Seoul Backpackers, Kim's Guest House, and more. I've only ever stayed in one guest house though, so the only one I can vouch for is Happy House. I had a lovely experience there. I called and reserved a room the day before I traveled up to Seoul for the Cotisal conference. Their phone number is 02-2234-2904. The best part is it only costs 16,000 won per night. It's so cheap. It looks just like an apartment inside. I was amazed. With all the amenities, a microwave, computer, water cooler, washing machine, TVs, it's clean and organized. And there are even things like subway maps posted around the place for your convenience. I did walk a bit too far um, when I got out of the subway, like finding the place. But when I realized I was walking toward the highway, I called the owner and she was really sweet to me on the phone. Um, she helped me figure out uh, how to get there. So I turned around, walked back, finally found the, the steep hill that I was supposed to turn onto. And I walked up this most interesting, narrow, winding, very traditional Korean street. And uh, finally at the top, across from the parking lot landmark, the owner was waiting right there for me outside. So uh, she was really nice about helping me out. It really is only about a five minute walk from the BOTA subway station. Um, that's on the Brown Line. It's only two stops away from Itaewon. And it was convenient for me too, going to the conference at Sukmyung Women's University. Happy House made me happy. Bottom line, it was cheap, clean, convenient, everything you'd want from a guest house, and more. If I were living in Korea any longer, I would definitely stay there again. I finally made it to my guest house, Happy House, and I'm going to take you on a short tour. So I'm lying on the bunk bed. Actually, I'm definitely not climbing up there. Ugh. And I'm going to be sharing this room with another woman from the U.S. We have some tissues, lockers, refrigerator, a TV, no computer though, I'm a little disappointed. Oh. It's like a little apartment. Oh, there's the computer. Never mind. Oh, this is good. There's a laundry machine. And a nice rack for hanging stuff up. Actually. Ooh. It's nice in there. Subway maps. On the table. In Korean and English. Wow. This is the front door, same kind of keypad lock as I have. 
on the table, another subway map, map of Seoul, microwave, recycling, water purifier, rice cooker, ooh, even the wall's pretty. So people staying in this room are two Korean women and one woman from Germany. And the bathroom, okay, the bathroom's actually really exciting. I had fun in here. I just took a shower, so it's all steamy. There's Colgate toothpaste. The Colgate is actually all in German. Whoa. And I don't know what this is, but it's not Korean. Oh, it's French. anti tatra Cool. Okay. Oh, that one's Korean. Oh, so we have a mix of everything. And over here, there's uh, some Arabic thing. I don't even know what it is. Body care product. And they give you lots of things to clean yourself with if you forgot them. This thing's in French. Which is very exciting for me. Yeah. So, that's the whole place. Oh, they give us towels and a hair dryer, some spare tissues, toilet paper. That's pretty exciting. Wow. Ugh. Whoa. Wow. Oh, this is good.